All right, everybody, I'm back again. This time I'm gonna do a quick review on some of the team transports that I picked up recently. One my wife had happened to find over at Walmart and uh, RWB, which I had to go to Amazon to get because apparently there are none anywhere near us. A Walmart, Target, no matter where you go, Apparently they don't believe in refilling the shelves with any kind of Hot Wheels. Or maybe I'm just too late and all the collectors have gotten them all. But every time I go, it's depleted. But anyway, on my little rant, I got one of my favorite vehicles of all time. R34 Skyline, this little hauler. Probably one of the most detailed, especially with the Nismo graphics on there. Real tail lamp, Stampos, headlamp. So we got the Z-Tune hood on it. And RWB I'll open in a second. Let's just take the Nissan off. Windows are gone off the driver and passenger side. TE37s, at least I believe they always are. Cool little gunnery flap on the spoiler. And the spoiler actually sits a little bit taller than some of the other GTRs. Some of them are a little bit closer to the deck lid, but this one has a little bit of a rise to it. There's the tail lamp. Exhaust. Might do a little bit of painting to make it look like titanium. As you can see, the needs no livery on there. Goes across the hood as well. Transport. Cool set of wheels on there. The rear moves. This is probably by far one of my favorite trucks, and it's funny because RWB has the same truck on there, the Aero Lift. It actually has the little divots to put the wheels in there. This one has a Hot Wheels logo versus the RWB it has the skull. Here's the RWB artwork. I actually saved this, the card stocks from each one of these transports and some of the other cooler art. These are the other ones that are in the set. You have the Mazda 787B. Usually it's in a different livery. Gritty, I think, has a livery for it. Old school Mazda, which is like a green and orange. You got the RWB Porsche that I'm about to show you and the Plymouth Superbird. So that's it for that series. Again, there's the front. That purple is just astonishing. I love purple. But the way they captured it in this RWB is just spot on and it matches the truck perfectly. There's not really too much flake in it. Um, great. This one has a little bit of a blemish in the top. It's got the double rise spoiler that most RWBs have depending on which body kit you end up getting. The exhaust. I'm gonna have to respray some of that. It's got the gold TEs. Deep dish in the rear. Small lip in the front. RWB logo on the windshield. A 
don't know if you can read the message that's in the front. Yeah, it's got the RWB logo on the bottom here. By the rocker panel. It has a little winglet here on the rear fenders, newer style. The truck actually has the same TEs that the Porsche does. There's my other RWB with the flat black. This one has no message on the hood. This has the black TEs versus the gold. Same thing with the rear deep dish. Same winglets. Pretty much the same exact setup as the other one. Huge rear fenders, same with the winglets, double rise spoiler. Just look at the size of those wheels. Spot on with the offsets, everything. Hot Wheels outdid themselves with this model from the RWB Porsche. I literally can buy all of them. Some of the other ones I've seen are eBay specials that you find from people that have custom made them. They look nice. I think, uh, I'm trying to remember the name, they also have them. I believe it's Tarmac Works. They seem to have a couple of RWB specials that they've made. I think some of them have been at Tokyo Auto Salon. I could be wrong, but I'll stick with my Hot Wheels. And that's pretty much it, guys. Those are the two new pickups. Love them both. RWB Porsche, along with the GTR, both with the Aero Lift transporters. And I'll leave it at that. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. A little bit in comparison between the two and then another GTR to add to the collection. I think Redline Club is coming up for 2020 renewals and they're actually releasing another GTR but I think it's in purple. I might have to just join to get that. I think last year's was a Chevy Camaro <laughs> that I'm still trying to get rid of because no one wants it apparently. So if you guys need it, hit me up. But other than that, have a good one, guys. Thanks.